welcome to another unboxing. Today we're unboxing the Veibusian Mini doll. And if you're waiting for a certain Lolita unboxing, I'm sorry it's taken me so long to uh, film it. I, I have filmed it, I'm sorry it's taken me so long to edit. Uh, I'm making some decisions regarding editing it and also just being lazy. But today we're unboxing a Veibusian Mini doll. And I have already unboxed a Lanwen G Mini doll six months ago and uh, for a while I thought I would just uh, limit myself to just having the Lanwenji mini doll because I usually have him when I cosplay Wei Wuxian because nobody cosplays Lanwenji with me so I have my own Lanwenji with me and uh, yeah I thought I would, I would just uh, maybe just have Lanchan for a while but I uh, I have seen the Wei Wuxian mini doll in person and I've been looking at him and uh, it it just it just feels unfair to have him be lonely. I think I think he deserves happiness. I think I deserve happiness in unboxing his uh, husband. So uh, spoilers, I guess. So today we're unboxing Gabby uh, Sam. Here's the box. I'm not gonna show you the other side because. Uh, there's my address on the other side. I used the exact same uh, seller that I used last time so that I can be certain that I actually get an original. Here we are. Here he is. Oh, by the way, uh, so I know that recently Minidol also announced that they're releasing a, uh, Vavisian, a version of Vavisian as the Ealing Lausu. And I did consider uh, looking at that as well. I did look at it and I decided that I like this uh, reincarnated version of Vavisian better uh, mainly because he looks happier. Uh, I have mentioned this earlier in my other figure unboxings and things that I like my figures to look as happy as possible. I don't like them to look crumpy or angry. Uh, anger is, is, is the one emotion I can't have on any of my dolls or figures or anything. I want them to look content. Now I know that we have Lanjan here who isn't like smiling <laughs> but um, I think he looks really cute. I think his expression is really cute. It's sort of shy and a little bit blushy and I think he doesn't look angry and I do like his expression a lot. So so that's that. And the uh, Elin Glausu Vavisian mini doll doesn't look like angry angry but I still prefer this Vavisian better because he's just uh, so happy and I mean it makes sense for Vavisian not to be happy in his healing clothes where uh, although there are like definitely times when he's uh, happy there as well but like it makes sense for his expression not to be so overjoyed but still I just prefer the version with uh, his really happy face. And I'm happy to report that um, if you watched my Lan Manji unboxing, then the box got quite damaged. But this box, this box looks great. And now I just need to not damage it myself when undoing these little stickers. And it's completely original. I can show you some close ups of the box later. But there's uh, these stickers that show that it's original. Uh, there's mini doll stickers, there's all the logos of all the uh, manufacturers and uh, also the companies uh, responsible for uh, the animation and the copyright and things. There we go! 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 Oh wow! Okay, there's more stickers. Okay, this one came out easier. Well. Oh! Hello! He's so cute! He's so cute! Of course he's naked. I feel slightly less... Okay, I'm gonna take him out with this uh, thing around him. I feel slightly less bad about uh, him being naked uh, than Lan Wenji because I feel like Lan Wenji is the shy... I mean, I don't really know, but you know, uh, maybe Sian is the shameless one, so... Oh my god, his hair is so soft! His hair is so soft! Yeah, he is, he is butt naked. He feels... Smaller than language. I know he is not supposed to be. I I have spoke to people about this. I think it's because uh, like the color uh, of he, 
his hair and everything creates this illusion that he is smaller somehow. I know that he is not, but he just he just looks smaller to me. His face is so cute. His face is so cute. I can't. He looks so happy. Okay. Here we have his uh, ID card. Uh, Lan Wen Chi had a similar one. So yeah. And here should be his clothes as well. I'm putting you aside for a moment. He has no like inherent markings. Like Lan Wen Chi has scars on him. But Wei Wuxian doesn't. Because this is his new buddy, and his new buddy... Well, he should have a stab wound from where Lin Lin... Lin... Lin uh, Jin, Jin Lin stabbed him. But maybe that's before that. Okay, so here we have his clothes in a nice little package. We should also have... Oh yeah, we have uh, some brand marks for the Wen brand, so we can brand him. I also still have most of Lan Wen Ji's brand. I have branded him. This makes me think of Lolita brands, and it's not that kind of brand. I have branded Lan Wen Ji's chest. Um, let me see if you can sort of see it here. So I'm just going to use the brands that come with Lan Wen Ji, the brand Wei Wuxian as well. Then I can keep these ones sealed, because uh, uh, Lan Wen Ji also came with eight brands. And not the good kind of brands. And here we have his shoes. By the way... Lan Wen Ji's shoes have gotten so dirty, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. But thankfully, Wei Wuxian's shoes are black and it does... Does it have a mini doll logo? I know it's supposed to have a mini doll logo, but I'm literally gonna... Yeah, it does have a mini doll logo. It looks different. It looks different than the one... Am I insane? Okay, no, it doesn't look different. I'm just insane. Yeah, it looks the same as, as uh, uh, Lan Wen Ji's. So there's a mini doll logo underneath his shoes. And where are his clothes? Let's undo his clothes as well. It says 28 and 39 on it. Not sure what that means, but okay. We have his uh, under robes, which I believe are these. And then we have this... Uh, oh, we have his hair tie as well, which is great. There's his hair tie. And his uh, belt. And then we have a little... Yeah, I think... Hmm. Basically a skirt. But, th but this comes together and, and becomes like a thing. Yeah, I think this is his under ropes. And these are actually... Yeah, these are the over overlaid ones. So you put these on top. I'm going to show you some close-ups, hopefully. I like that they have silver lining. These are really good quality. The detailing is amazing. The skirt is actually grey and has an elastic here. And then we have those little things that go on his uh, hands. Those sort of wrist, wrist cups. I am using a lot of Lolita terminology here, but I mean, these... I guess they're not really wrist cuffs, but like, what am I supposed to call them? They're not gloves. They don't cover his fingers. I, I guess they can be finger. Mm, they're, they're wrist cuffs. I've, I've decided they're wrist cuffs. Mm, and we also get, as we did with Lan Wen Chi, we also get a thing with a bunch of QR codes that are only relevant in China. And a thing, and you don't get an envelope, I think. You, I got an, oh, I do. Never mind. No, I don't. No. Okay, this isn't there. Oh, I got this uh, envelope with Lan Wen Ji that I don't see here. And you also get instructions in Chinese. So, um, yeah. It says to squish his face, I think. I don't know. <laughs> it, it looks like it says to squish his face. Uh, you 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 decide. I could try and Google Translate it, but I'm not going to because this is more fun. I'm gonna dress him. Here we have Wei Wuxian fully dressed. I struggled with his hair. Like his hair looks so perfect and wonderful on the image here, but I struggled to get it looking like that. I I'm okay-ish with how it looks now. Uh, but, um, I mean, he's Wei Wuxian, he's very mischievous and he runs around a lot. So I feel like it's okay if his hair is, like, not the neatest. Uh, thankfully it's not Lan Zhan. 
um, he was he was decently he was like medium hard to dress I, I feel like it was okay I, I uh, straightened out some of his ropes more than I did in the close-ups so now you can see how he's supposed to look in the back these wrist cuffs he has are sort of a leathery material that feels very genuine like I, I imagine that's how it would feel like in the series um, also this uh, sleeve sleeve pattern over here is the same material so the rubbery material as the clouds on Lanjan's robes um, his hair is is so weird because it's it's basically like a slab of hair i mean it's it's uh, similar with the uh, uh lan ji but it does feel like a ponytail like if i if i uh, try to like uh, if i try to like make his hairband look neater and i'm just gonna make it worse then it, it it does sort of feel like a ponytail which is so cool it's also one of those materials that really gets stuck to your nails so if your nails have like any sort of imperfections it, it's gonna snag right away uh, so yeah uh, keep that in mind um, his shoes look really nice uh, they're black so I'm hoping they're not gonna be in the same state as Lanonji's shoes are he, he's not doing any walking I don't know how they get so dirty it's it's not like he goes on night hunts for real or something uh, I also um, I also realized that I don't really understand why they put brands with him with this outfit because he is, this is like his Mosia new outfit so he's reincarnated he's in a new body he isn't supposed to have a brand so I'm not gonna brand him um, if he had his Cloud Reese's outfit which you can also get it's over here you can see it in the back then uh, yeah uh, then it would make sense because then actually no does he yeah i guess he wears that outfit when we're in the cave yeah he does so yeah then it would then it would make sense but i don't i don't get it uh, why, why have they put it here i am tempted to get uh, the other outfit for him as well just because i do like his other outfit as well um, and also i on the picture it comes with this uh, portrait of lanchan but I guess it doesn't come with that for real because this outfit is supposed to come with an apple if you look if you look at the picture like like on here then he he is holding an apple but it doesn't actually come with an apple so uh, yeah I think it's not supposed to I think the apple comes with a little, little apple and before you ask no I'm not gonna buy a little apple I'm, I, I think I think I'm not going that far it is so adorable I I, I, I'm still like squeeing over the fact that he is so cute. His hair is so so soft and uh, yeah look at his face. Look at his face. Uh, they're so adorable. He's, uh, he's adorable. I swear he looks like it's, it's an optical illusion because they're the exact same size but because Lan uh, Wanji is in so much lighter colors and Vivian is dressed really darkly I feel like he looks optically smaller uh, I know that they're the exact same size but like I think like Wei Wuxian's hair also like frames his face in a way that makes his face look smaller and it does kind of make sense because he is like slightly shorter in this series and tends to be like smaller if you have enjoyed this video of, of me fangirling um, oh yeah I did I mention so the longer robe goes uh, goes underneath in this case. I was I was confused because with Lanjan the uh, longer robe goes over his other robes to get the right look. But with him, this uh, like one with the shorter sleeves is the over robe, the the second layer, uh, so that you can get the right look that he has. If you have enjoyed this video, leave a like. Uh, comment uh, if you'd like to see more doll related content then subscribe I also do a lot of Lolita related content so if any of that is of interest to you and just uh, also a lot of Winx Club related content from from time to time it does happen so yeah leave a like uh, leave a comment below do you own these dolls I if you don't I highly recommend getting them because they are so cute the quality is excellent and they are they are so adorable like i struggled dressing him because i just get sidetracked he he has the cutest cutest little plushy face and 
he's adorable and I love him and I'm so glad to have him and I'll see you in my next video bye look how cute they are look how cute they are